I have known so many people that are haunted by their past. Something that happened to them or something they did to others. And yet, if you're smart, spiritually smart, you will leave the past where it belongs in the past. You will not bring it up and relive it every day. Leave the broken, irreversible past in God's hands and step out into the invincible future with God. In Job 22, verse 21, it says, Come to terms with God and be at peace. In this way, good will come to you. A lot of us read our Bible verses too quickly. When we're at peace, good is attracted to us like a magnet. We don't have to work for it. We can go through the easy way in life and just have it appear. It is a wonderful way to live life. But if you're embittered by a personal tragedy, that you didn't deserve, and you still can't understand, it is time right now to accept the unchangeable past and embrace the priceless present and be at peace and have faith in God's promises for tomorrow. God's plans for you are good. And if you really believe that, that God's plans for you are good. Well, that'll change everything. It'll change the way that you walk into a room. It'll change the way you walk into tomorrow and walk into your future. And you'll soon become a magnet for good instead of bad. Come to God and reclaim that peace God's peace that can be yours. It is God's will for you to have peace. Again, I repeat Job, come to terms with God and be at peace. In this way, good will come to you.